owl is in my backyard and I was just getting ready to read you a story and he started hooting at me. Hopefully you heard it. There's one way in the distance that I think the owl in my backyard is talking to. Milo heard it. This Milo, see he's sitting there. And he, it, his ears perked up because he heard it too. Well, I guess maybe he flew over to where the other owl was talking. I don't know. Hmm. That's a different way to start a story. Time, isn't it? Just listening to the that owl is far away now. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's my that's my imitation of an owl. It's not that good, but he talks to me. I can hear the other birds. Quite a few birds out today. I guess since we had a different beginning. Let's just get to our story. And maybe the owl will talk some more to us. That'll be so cool. <clears throat> this book is a book that I've had for a while. It's easy to read. I heard him again. Easy to read Disney stories. So this book on the cover, it has a lot of different pictures of the different animals and the different stories and the different people that are in this book. This book is a book that has a cover like we have, right? The cover of the book, front and back. The spine, we talked about the spine all the time. Keeps the pages and the books together. And this is a collection. It's a collection of different stories. That means it's not just one story. It means it's a bunch of different stories. And with that kind of a book, we find, again, we've talked about this before, a table of contents. In this book, on this page, it says contents. Contents, right there. Contents. And what that means is this is a list of the stories that you can read. And it has the page number on them. So the one story I like to read a lot, it's fun, is Buzz and the Bubble Planet. And see what it says right here? Toy Story, Buzz and the Bubble Planet. And it's on page six. So, here's a picture, Buzz and the Bubble Planet. Let's look at that picture. Hmm, what do you think this story is going to be about? Look at Buzz. There's a lot of bubbles. And I see, I see a, it looks like a boat. Yeah, it looks like a boat all surrounded by the bubbles. There was a new Toy in Andy's room. It looks like a spaceship, said Woody. Did you say spaceship? Buzz asked. There's a picture. Those are all the toys in Andy's room. Buzz got in the spaceship. Woody told Buzz to be careful. Okay, there's that spaceship there. It's standing up that way. And here's Buzz. He's sitting in that spaceship. And look at Woody. Look at his face. Woody kind of looks worried. He's like, Woody told Buzz, be careful. Buzz was ready to blast off. Buzz, don't go, Woody said. Uh-oh. Woody hit the on switch. See that? Uh-oh. Like when we were doing our, when we were doing 
spaceships and astronauts and space, we used to do a countdown. Ready? Let's do it. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Blast off! Uh-oh. Whoosh! The spaceship went up, up, and away. Then it came down and Buzz fell out. There he is. There he is. There's that spaceship. Inside the spaceship. You know, you can make a, a spaceship of your, on your own. At, at home, if you got a box, you can take a box and, and put some stuff in it and pretend it's a spaceship. Or you can even take a blanket and put it over a chair and get underneath it and pretend it's a blank, pretend it's a spaceship. Yeah. Or you can go outside, outside and sit under a tree and pretend that's a spaceship too. You can do all kinds of pretend things. Buzz landed in some water and he jumped out. The water went down. There you go, he landed in water. Hmm. What does that look like to you? That's what he landed in. It's got a, it's got a top, it's like a cover, and there's a bowl here, and there was water inside. Oh my, oh my, oh my. I think Buzz landed in a toilet. Doesn't it look like a toilet? And the words say, Buzz landed in some water. He jumped out, but the water went down. So when he jumped out, he, he stepped on the handle and the water went down. Buzz landed in a toilet. I think that's a clue. I think that's a clue of where maybe Buzz might be. I'm on a strange planet, said Buzz. I must look around. After all, I am Buzz Lightyear. But how will I get home, he said. How is he going to get home? Hmm. Look what he's got over here. He's holding on that and he's drying himself off. What is it? You might hear mommies or daddies or aunties or uncle or somebody in your house or even if you're watching TV, people are complaining when they go to the store, they can't find toilet paper because a lot of people have bought toilet paper. They didn't want to run out of it while we had to stay home. But Buzz has got his own toilet paper. Back in Andy's room, the toys held a meeting. We must find Buzz, said Woody. I will send out the green army men, said Sarge. Great idea, said the toys. There's all the toys. They are so worried about Buzz. Like, where did he go? Buzz was in trouble. A robot was pushing him. It shook in his hands. Buzz could not hold on. Buzz hit a button and the robot stopped. Oh, oh, what a crazy looking robot. Hmm, I think if you guys look at that picture, you know what it is. Buzz thinks it's a robot. Next, strong winds pushed Buzz. He slipped on a rock and he was covered in blue slime. There's the, the thing that the strong winds are coming out of. Oh, and he stepped on a rock right there. And he was covered with blue slime? Boy, I think if we look at these pictures, we know what got blue slimed on him. What was it? Buzz saw Andy's cat, Whiskers. Do not worry, Whiskers. I will rescue you, said Buzz. And the cat's tail swung and hit Buzz. Swung right at him. Thump! Buzz fell back and he found himself in a red boat. This planet moves too much, said Buzz. There he is, he's in the red boat. Buzz saw yellow aliens. They swam to him. 
Who is your leader? Buzz called. Squeak, 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 said the yellow alien. Boy, he's still in that boat. Hmm. Buzz's wings opened. His wings hit a bottle of squeaky clean bottle bubbles. There it is. Squeaky clean bubbles. You must be Squeak, Buzz said. I am Buzz Lightyear. I come in peace. There he is. The pink goo came out of Squeak's head. The goo turned into lots of bubbles. Buzz slapped the bubbles but they were all around him. Look at him, he's all covered around with bubbles. Sarge and his men saw Buzz. Sarge called Woody. Should we save him, he asked. There they are. Do not worry, said Woody. Help is on the way. Woody knew what was going on now. Back on the bubble planet, Buzz was in trouble again. Aliens were all around him. Soon he would fall into Squeak's bubble trap. Oh no, he's getting covered with bubbles. Sounds like fun to me. At last, help came. Andy was on the bubble planet and Andy had Woody. Let's go, partners, Andy said. There they are. Andy to the rescue. What do you think Andy is going to do now? What do you think he's going to do with Buzz and Moody? Hmm. Look at what they're doing. Andy is taking a bath. And there's Buzz. And there's Woody. The bubble planet was not so scary anymore. Buzz was happy. His friends were here. And he was squeaky clean. To infinity and beyond. Here's Buzz Lightyear. Isn't that a fun little story? I like that story. He's using a lot of bubbles, Buzz is. And I hope we're still practicing, right? A, B, C, D. Oh, let's stop first. Let's do the let's do the steps. Let's pretend we're putting the water on. Get our hands wet. Okay, the water's on. Let's squish the bubbles, the soap, onto our hands. A nice good thing of, of bubbles in the middle of our hand. Ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Wash those germs right off of me. Use that soap with lots of bubbles. Now those germs are in big trouble. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Look how clean my hands can be. You know what to do. Rinse those dirty bubbles down the drain. Rinse them down the drain. They are such a pain. Now we have to, we have to do what? Dry your hands, ready? Take one or two paper towels. One or two, don't take three, save a tree. Dry them off good. Have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow. And I hope you enjoyed listening to our owl that lives here in my yard. And we'll see you tomorrow. Love you.